Hi, my name is Robert. This video is designed to give you step-by-step -step detailed instructions on completing the task at hand. Please read the comments in the About section of this video. It has valuable information and updates. My YouTube channel has a disclaimer video that I encourage you to watch. And please, like, share, and subscribe. I hope you find what you're looking for. Thank you very much for watching. In this video, I'm going to show you how to deal with wood that has screws in them that are stripped. The holes are stripped out. You can't tighten the screws down. That goes for locks, latches, door places like that, hinge holes, all of these places that have screws in them that the screw strips out and you can't get the screw tight no more just because it's stripped. Holes like that. We couldn't get these screws in this lock tight. All four of them were stripped. None of them would tighten up. The thing I do is go ahead and remove all the screws, get the screws and the latch or whatever out of the way. After you have the part out of the way, you can see the holes in which are stripped out. So this is what I do. So simple, so easy. As long as the door is not damaged, split open or the door jam or anything like that, all you need to do is go to a hardware store or a hobby store is even better because they have different sizes. This is called a dowel rod. You take a dowel rod. You want it small enough to fit in the hole. You push it in the hole as far as it'll go and you just snap it off in the hole. That fills the hole with fresh wood. This is normally good strong wood and then you simply re-screw the screw in the hole. You can put glue on it if you want, but that's not even necessary. Now, I put the dowel rod in the holes, I break it off, and if for some reason your dowel rod is a little too fat, you can trim it down with a knife or anything. As long as you can get most of that hole filled and break that dowel rod off, you can screw your screws back in nice and tight. Now the latch is up, very secure, good to go. The cabinet door hinge, the screw stripped out. Take a little dowel rod, stick, stick it in the hole, push it in as far as you can, break it off. If you want to tap it in with a screwdriver or something, you can. Let me get that little piece and put it in there. Tapped it in there with the screwdriver handle. Now I'm going to put the hinge in place and put the screw back in. If you feel that this information was useful, please like it and share it with your social media friends. You can subscribe to my channel so that you will get notifications of future videos that I post. You can follow me on Twitter, and if you need to contact me directly, please visit my website. And if you have any questions, leave them below, and someone or myself will reply to them. Again, thank you very much for watching.